Hey YouTube. Um, long time no see. I just realized after looking at some comments, some recent comments that I got on the video that I had done um, a while back about why I left the organized church and institutionalized religion. No, the institutional church and organized religion. I realized that it's been six years since I put out the video. And um, that's a long time. It seemed like that time went by really, really quick. So I figured now would be the perfect time for an update on where I am now and what I believe, which is I still feel exactly the same way. I still don't fool with church and I um, still don't believe in organized religion. As a matter of fact, my, damn it, is that the, as a matter of fact, my beliefs have totally changed altogether. Um, and I know this is going to be an un, uh, unpopular opinion, but I can't even say that I subscribe to the whole uh, Jesus is returning thing anymore. Mm, it took me a long time after leaving church to come to that decision, but eventually I got to the place where I was questioning a lot of things. And it all basically came from reading the Bible, reading the Bible, getting into it, um, trying to study various things and running across scriptures that didn't really make sense and then thinking logically about some stuff that don't make any sense. And so I've come to a decision uh, that I'm open to receiving knowledge about other things and not just what I was taught to believe. Because although I had got rid of a lot of things a lot of traditional mindsets about the things that I was taught when I was growing up in church. Uh, there were still some residual beliefs that were there that also needed to be trashed and I needed to be deprogrammed of. So now I am in a place where I feel like I'm on a journey. I'm open for, for I'm open for receiving knowledge from different things about different stuff. Um, I'm not going to limit myself to just one thing. And I'm going to trust and believe that while I'm on this path, that whatever is for me will be revealed to me and that um, I'll be put on the correct path that I need to be on before I leave this world. But my thing is with the um, Christians, I, particularly after I, you know, changed my beliefs, there was blowback. And, you know, you have to deal with the ones who are going to condemn you to hell and just beat it across your head that Jesus is the way. But um, I don't believe in that. I don't believe in forcing my beliefs on anybody. And I don't want them forcing their beliefs on me. And I think as human beings, we are all of the time evolving. Well, most of us are where I would like to think that most of us are. But we're all the time evolving and we all aren't going to evolve at the same time. So my thing is I just leave people alone and I just let people get where they need to be, when they need to be, or how, however long it, it takes them. That's on them, you know. So I, I definitely believe in respect. I respect everyone and where they are at what point they are in their lives. And for me, I'm at a point where I'm not looking for Jesus to return and save me. I'm just not. I'm looking to evolve to my higher self and uh, however that happens, it happens. But how I've, I've been doing it in the past, it just has not resonated with me. And I, I mean, guys, I was in church for a long time. And even after I got out of church, I still, I prayed and things seemed to be better, but I still did not feel connected. And I guess right now what I'm looking for is something that I can really and truly connect to. And when I find it, <laughs> I'll be back and let y'all know, because as of yet, I still haven't found it. But, um, yeah, that's my little update on where I am. And um, it is what it is. 
So take care, everyone, and bye.